Judge Arthur Engeron, who's overseeing Letitia James' fraud lawsuit against Donald Trump, his family, and his organization, said that he would come up with a final verdict, uh, determine a number that Donald Trump and everyone else would have to pay after being found liable of massive fraud. He said he would do that by January 31st, or at least he said he hoped he could do it by January 1st. Well, of course, it's February 2nd. Everybody's freaking out. Oh, my God, what happened? Something went wrong. Oh, my God. Just relax. Chill the fuck out. I'll tell you why there's been a delay. And it's not beneficial to Donald Trump. You see, just a day or so ago, we heard that Ellen Weisselberg, the CFO for the Trump Organization, is pleading out to a perjury charge by Elvin Bragg in the Manhattan District. Now, the interesting thing about this perjury, this perjury would have been committed in front of Judge Engeron in this particular trial. So Judge Engeron is saying to himself, look, this motherfucker lied to me. I better find out what's going on so I know all the facts before I make the determination as to what Donald Trump owes the state of New York. Now, the delay says early February to mid-February. It's February 2nd. Right now, it's early February. So it could come at any time. But people I know are looking at the negative side saying, oh, something went wrong. Nothing went wrong for us. Everything's going wrong for fucking Donald Trump.